hello everyone and welcome back to our tutorial on html5 multimedia element in today's video we will be discussing how to use video and audio element in html5 to add multimedia content in your web page this element make it possible to play audio and video file without the need of third-party plugin like adobe flex let's dive in and learn how to use the element effectively first start with html5 audio element HTML5 audio element is used to play audio files such as MP3, OGG, and AAC. All browsers supporting audio element have built-in player. To add audio element in your web page, you can use audio tag with the src attribute and the control attribute to display control bar to the user. Here is an example. I'm going to use this sound so for so in a source sound.mp3 then you can display the control bar using the control attribute here you can see and we can play this And we can stop we can also use source tag to specify multiple audio format for that we have to write source src and when we provide a source here we do not need to provide the source here so i'm gonna cut that and paste it here then we also have to write the type which is audio type and it is mp3 and if you have different audio format like ogg you can specify here too providing audio in different audio format is being useful when you want to make sure that the audio should be played in different application because some application only play mp3 some application only play ogg so providing audio in different audio format is really helpful you can also add custom functionality for that you can use javascript property and method so for this first i'm gonna let's make a play button so for that i'm gonna write button and when the button is click we want to play the audio so i will write that function later then let's give it a name play audio then here we have to write now we select the audio let's use this audio and when we click this button we want to play this audio it is a function so save this and let's play this and you can see it plays now let's add pause button and rewrite it to pause so now we can play and pause play pause we can also see the property of the audio so for this let's make a function that will display the property of the audio by this we can check whether the audio has been paused or not and the property is current time another is duration we also have volume property
now let's call this function whenever user click this button so um, here I'm gonna write so property it will call the so property function also here and to see this we have to open the console now when I press play audio oh sorry I also have to provide the parenthesis here and here also now when I press a play button here you can see the property here you can see the property we can also see the property when we press the pause button we can also mute this audio using mute attribute you can see by default it is mute and when I change the volume and press pause here you can see the volume is 43 percent I hope you understand about the audio element now let's jump into the video element the HTML5 video element or video tag is used to add video to your web page. It supports format like MP4, OGG and S.426. To embed a video, create a video tag with a SRC attribute and a control attribute to display the control bar to the user. The video and audio element are quite similar. So and I'm gonna change the audio with video and on the source i'm going to provide this video link which is password generator let's reduce the size of video by using width and height width let's set it to 320 and height to 40. i think width is enough so we do not have to we do not need the height just set the width to add a functionality in your video you can use similar property and method that you use in your audio so we do not have to change this even though it it work okay it does not work because here i'm selecting the audio but here we have the video so uh, i'm gonna write video now it should work but for the readability let's change this audio to the video and also here now it plays even though we can fully screen by clicking here let's add a button to do so so here I'm gonna write the full screen and right here request full screen and it is a function so I have to give a parenthesis it plays we can pause we can also make it full screen and that's it for our today's tutorial on html5 multimedia element now you have a better understanding of how to use audio and video element in html5 to add multimedia content in your web page this element provides an easy and effective way to include audio and video file without relying on third-party plugin Thanks for watching and happy coding.